Okay, I'm going to show you now how you can bring in the Bitmoji extension and have it as part of your Chrome browser so that you can easily import your Bitmoji avatar into your virtual classroom. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to open up Chrome and then you're going to go into the apps and then you're going to click on the web store. Then you're going to go ahead and just search for Bitmoji. And then you'll see this is the extension and you'll have a button that says add to Chrome and that's what you'll click. You'll go through the steps and then it'll show up right up here. Now you have to have your Bitmoji account and your avatar already set up and designed. So if you are new to Bitmoji and you do not have that done yet, you're going to want to download the Bitmoji um, app for either your iPhone or your Android device. And then you're gonna log in, you're gonna create your account, you're gonna log in, you're gonna design your, your avatar. And once you've done that, then you'll be able to log in. Once the first time you click on this extension up here, it'll ask you to log in. And then once you've logged in and connected your account, um, then you'll be able to, every time you click on this extension, you'll be able to grab um, an avatar. So if you see here, as soon as I open up the extension, I can see a lot of the more popular avatars, and these are definitely some newer ones. That's pretty cool. Um, they do update them. You can also search. And, or you can go down to the bottom and you can click through the categories. So the popular, this is, what is that? You know, saying hi, I guess. Then you have the loved ones, the happy ones, the not so happy ones, and the celebrating ones. So if you're not quite sure what you want, you click through the categories and find something that works for you. All right, so once you have found something that you like, let's go back to this. Um, you right click, and then you're gonna do copy image, and then you're gonna go into your classroom. No, I'm going to put myself here because I don't know where my other one went. And just paste yourself right in there. There it goes. Just where you want to have it. And then as I do with all my images, I go into format, format options, and I throw a drop shadow in there. And that's, that's it. That's how you go through the process. Now, one thing that may happen to you at some point or another is that this may suddenly disappear. Maybe you run out of room, um, there's an update, and suddenly it looks like it's gone. But then you go into the store and you see that you can't add it because you already have it. So what you need to do to find it is right-click on any of the extensions that you have up here, and you'll go down to where it says Manage Extensions. And then when you're in here and manage, manage extensions, you'll hit that back button. And then you'll see all the extensions that you have. And you'll, then you'll just want to find the Bitmoji and make sure that, see, when that's toggled off, it disappears. Make sure that's toggled on. And then you'll have access again to your Bitmoji extension. And that's it.